Awareness Month, and every Monday for the whole month of October, I will be educating and bringing awareness to spina bifida. So exactly how many people are born with spina bifida? Each year it's estimated that 1,500 babies are born with spina bifida in the United States. In Canada, there are about 260 babies that are born with it. Recent research, however, has estimated it. that Americans living with all forms of spina bifida may be as high as 166,000. In 1992, the United States Public Health Service recommended that those who could have children should consume 400 micrograms of folic acid daily to reduce the risk of a baby developing spina bifida. I never Since knew that either. The amount of those born with spina bifida has decreased slightly. It's important to know that there is no cure for spina bifida, but there are many ways to help prevent it. But if a baby is born with spina bifida, it's not the end of the world. People with spina bifida live healthy and happy lives and will continue doing so as long as spina bifida is made aware and people care about our lives. So there are some facts on how many people are born with spina bifida. If you want to know more on spina bifida, please check out my playlist, hashtag spina bifida, for more info. And if you like this video and want to help support me, please consider becoming a patron on my Patreon page. You'll be able to get cool perks like being able to Skype me and get videos a day before they come out. The link for that will be in the description below. See you next Monday for another Spina Bifida Awareness video. As far as the number of people in America with Spina Bifida, I know I said that was a lot, but when you think about it, it's like over 10 billion people in this world alone. So... I wonder how many is it in the world because it's not it's under a thousand in Canada which is even less than America <clears throat> so it's not really that many people with spina bifida according to this video considering the fact that like I said there's billions of people in this world but meeting somebody with spina bifida is almost like a it's like a bitter sweet feeling I guess if that's that's the term you want to use or for me, a lack of a better time because it's cool meeting somebody you can relate to, but it's unfortunate because I don't, like I said in plenty of other videos, I don't wish this on nobody, but meeting somebody with spina bifida is, it's almost like, wow, we can relate on something more than just being humans, you know, or we can relate on something deeper than just uh, we both the same race or we both the same age or we both like the same music. Or we both like the same TV shows. We can relate on a deeper level. And you can understand me. Understand where I'm coming from. And I can understand you. And understand where you're coming from. Because. As far as like dating. Dating somebody who got spina bifida. Because I've talked to somebody with spina bifida before. And. Um, they was very understanding of my situation. Just like I was of theirs. And when. And when I noticed I tend to date out of the spina bifida or the disabled, excuse me, community. I tend to meet people who have a misunderstanding or a disconnect from my situation and my lifestyle and the way I live from theirs, you know? So meeting somebody with spina bifida, like I said, it's unfortunate that this thing even exists. And I wish all good health to every human. With no matter what you got, spina bifida, cerebral palsy, lupus, no matter what you got. I'm just speaking on spina, spina bifida specifically because that's what I got. And that's what this video is about in the Spina Bifida Awareness Month. But um, it's unfortunate that health issues exist and that we have to go through it. But, you know, I'm a firm believer in God. So I feel like he gives people what they can handle and enough of what they can handle and never give them too much so I'll never complain about even though I have and I ain't gonna say I'll never complain again cause I might have another bad day one day I haven't had a bad day in a while pertaining to my spina bifida but I try to complain as least as possible about my situation considering the fact that it could have been a whole lot worse Y'all seen my previous videos about Spina Bifida. If you haven't, go check them out. Just type in my name, Noble Page Patrick, Spina Bifida, and all my Spina Bifida videos will come up. I might even do a Spina Bifida playlist with all my Spina Bifida videos. Excuse me. But, um, yeah, man. Y'all be blessed. Have a great day. I love y'all. 335 subscribers, I think. I love all y'all.